If you need any Ultimate Team coins, head over to footcoinking.com. There's a link in the description. And if you use my discount code CHES, C-H-E-S, as you can see on screen, you'll get yourself an extra 5% off. Hey guys, how's it going? Chez back again with another episode of Luis Suarez's Road to Redemption. Now, unfortunately, in the last episode yesterday, we had a little bit of a setback. We've been winning games left, right and centre recently, and uh, we actually came out with a draw and a defeat without scoring any goals in yesterday's episode. So we're hoping Wayne Rooney, who we managed to pull in one of those 100k packs, can be the instigator when it comes to creating some chances, putting them in the back of the net, and fingers crossed we can come out with some wins in today's episode. In the first game, we come up against an all-Brazilian side, quite strong all-Brazilian Brazilian side as well, considering uh, his back four are particularly good, and his midfield three, uh, midfield three with uh, Ronaldinho sat up top as well, alongside Pato and Leandro, is it perhaps the uh, Palmeiras uh, striker? I'm not too sure. I know he's quite quick though, but uh, we had a corner on the half hour and somehow Marouane Fellaini's header is able to loop up into the back of the net. They said in commentary in game that it had taken a deflection but I couldn't tell from the replay whether it actually had or whether it was just a perfectly weighted looped header over the top of Julius Cesar who can only just stand there and watch as it drops over his head underneath the bar and into the back of the net and then as it ah, I appear to have missed out his goal. Um, uh, apologies for that, but let's crack on. Musa Sissoko whips the ball into the back, in, into the box, and uh, Rain Rooney with a stupendous overhead kick, almost uh, mimicking his, his one against Manchester City for United a few years ago. Although he, he kind of shinned that one, the one that Sky Sports used to use on all of their uh, all of their footage, etc. But this is a particularly good overhead kick on his left foot, back across goal, under pressure from the defender. A world-class goal from Wayne Rooney. And he's actually going to get himself a second assist here as well. And Fellaini gets himself a second goal with his head. This time it does hit the bar and goes down into the back of the net. And again, Julius Cesar has absolutely no chance with 3-1 up. And then a defensive mistake from him is going to let Rooney in again. He's going to take it around David Luiz really nicely there to step inside the challenge. Shrugs off the attentions of the defender on his shoulder. Slots it really nicely into that bottom corner. And we wanted Wayne Rooney to be the instigator in this game. And he's got two goals and two assists. And we could not have asked anything else of him. And that, in fact, brought the rage quit. So Luis Suarez doesn't get a goal or an assist. But uh, Wayne Rooney does it all himself. Fellaini, two goals. Rooney, two goals. And uh, two assists as well to get a man in the match performance. And we get to open a pack for the Rage Quit as well. So, uh, of course, no special packs in the store at this particular moment in time, unfortunately. So uh, we can only open a 7.5k pack. But hopefully there'll be something inside it that we can use. Because, of course, we're still looking for uh, for a players to improve the squad whilst we build towards the target team. We actually get two BPL players, one of which is Leroy Fur, second of which is the transferred Arsenal Debussy. Now, we've got better right-backs than that, unfortunately, but uh, it's still nice to pull a transferred player in uh, in our first pack of this episode. It's the first episode since all of the other uh, transfers went into packs, so we're pleased with that, to be honest. Uh, maybe I will occasionally give him the odd game just to see what uh, Mathieu Debussy actually plays like. Maybe if we play Vermaelen at centre-back, I'll bring in Debussy at right-back to get uh, some stronger chemistry but still and um, we come up in the second game against another really really strong Barclays Premier League side it's got Santi Cazorla weirdly at CDM alongside man of the match uh, Aaron Ramsey Ertzel Oscar at Cam Suarez his normal original 86 card and uh, Robin Van Persie up top and are we again we're going to be playing Rooney in that camera and the first goal that came it's going to be age ridden completely you can see so many rebounds it is eventually going to drop to Valencia who smashes it into the back of the net I felt sorry for the guy and I just skipped all of the replays immediately went back to the kickoff because uh, that was just a terrible terrible way to take the lead I'm not proud of goals like that whatsoever but Wayne Rooney's going to have another corner here 12 minutes into the game he whips it in Sissoko I was going to try and head that down to the man on the edge of the box but it actually hit the defender came back to Musa Sissoko and another kind of aidsy goal really to be completely honest ends up with the ball in the back of the net and we take a 2-0 lead really early on and yet again Wayne Rooney gets an assist from a corner I'm not really too sure whether it will count as an assist from a corner because of the way that Sissoko headed it against the defender etc but it's pretty safe to say that Wayne Rooney's corner was the reason that that goal was scored but Luis Suarez breaks through here lovely Maradona turn drills it towards the bottom corner but Hugo Lloris is on hand to push it onto the post we're trying desperately for the rest of the game just to get Luis Suarez a goal he hasn't scored for 
three games now, and this will be the fourth if he doesn't do so in this one. And uh, he hasn't picked up an assist in either of those three games either. So uh, I was just desperate for Suarez to do something that meant we could open a pack on his behalf. But Hugo Lloris again with another top save and uh, keeps him out in first half stoppage time. Then we're into the end of the second half now. Again, another defensive mistake is picked off by Musa Sissoko. It's going to find Wayne Rooney, who in turn will find Luis Suarez. Good turn to get around David Luiz. Finds a bit of space. Again, drills it towards the bottom corner. And again, Hugo Lloris comes up with a top class save. So Luis Suarez, unfortunately, again, for the fourth game in a row and second episode in a row, doesn't score and doesn't get an assist. However, we do get six points. So in the overall grand scheme of things, it doesn't matter. But he did have five shots. He did have six shots, five of which were on target. So at least he's still creating the opportunities and having the opportunities. He's just not necessarily putting them away. But still... All that matters at this particular stage is the fact that we're gaining points. As you can see, we're now only three points from promotion in Division 6 and only six points from the title with four games remaining. So fingers crossed we can uh, sew up at least promotion in the next episode tomorrow. If not, that uh, that title win and you guys will have another decision to make for the target team. Just doing some uh, some general squad maintenance in the background. I think I'm going to play Lucas in the next game, get him back in the starting lineup. But that's all for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. There will have been a My Player episode uploaded earlier on this afternoon, so check your channel to or check the channel page or your sub box for that. Of course, if uh, you missed anything else on the channel over the past few days, whether it's this series, the My Player series, or uh, the Dortmund Career Mode series, then of course check the channel page for it. There's a description. There's a description. Of course, there's a description down below. There's a schedule in the description down below if you don't know what and when I upload so that you know exactly what and when to expect stuff from me. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're closing in on 15 and a half K subs now. Hopefully, we can uh, we can hit 16 uh, by the end of. August perhaps, maybe even halfway through August, I've no idea, we're going at a great rate at the minute, growing really, really nicely, but as you can see, Luis Suarez has done quite well for us, 46 goals and 14 assists in 38 games, so uh, perhaps we can allow him a little bit of a dry spell, but anyway, it's going to bring this one to a close, guys, thank you very much for watching, drop the video a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't, follow me on Twitter, at Chesnoid Gaming, follow me on Instagram, Chesnoid, and uh, I'll see you next time.